On behalf of the men and women of the largest joint base in the Department of Defense, welcome to the 502nd Air Base Wing and Joint Base San Antonio Change of Command Ceremony, where we pay tribute to Brigadier General Heather L. Pringle as she relinquishes command as a devoted and tireless leader and honor Brigadier General Laura L. Lenderman as she assumes leadership and command. And today's ceremony is more than just the handing of a guide on between one leader and another. It, it is a covenant to this sacred responsibility of those that defend our values enshrined in our Constitution. Because JBSA is my family, and this wing is my pride and joy. But when General Quas selected you, my dreams were answered. You are a wonderful person, role model, and leader. You lead with strength, and heart, and the 502nd will flourish under your care. In effective 6 June 2018, Brigadier General Heather L. Pringle relinquishes command of the 502nd Air Base Wing and Joint Base San Antonio. And effective 6 June 2018, Brigadier General Laura L. Lenderman assumes command of the 502nd Air Base Wing and Joint Base San Antonio. It is truly an honor to be here with all of you on this historic installation on a beautiful, and slightly warm Texas morning. Let me begin by saying thank you. Lieutenant General Quast, sir, thank you for your visionary leadership and for this tremendous opportunity to command this incredible wing and support this unparalleled joint base community. And every day we honor our motto, one team, one mission. Every day, in big ways and small, we help others be successful. And as we lift others up and help them reach their full potential and fulfill their missions, we must communicate clearly, we must cooperate completely, and we must collaborate continuously to create innovative solutions that keep Joint Base San Antonio working smoothly and efficiently. We do this together. We do this with respect. We do this with dignity. One mission, one team together. This is what we do, this is what we've always done, and this is what we'll continue to do. So as I close, I thank you. Thank you for the opportunity to serve with all of you. May God bless you, your families, and the United States of America. Thank you.